I have this document in multiple page views so that you can see two pages here. Uh, but you may want to take one minute to do a new window. And if you click that, what you're going to notice is you'll get a second window uh, with a number two here, and one will have a number one here. Take the number one, put it on your left screen. Take the number two, put it on your right monitor. And that way you can scroll into both and see what you're doing. But it won't work while I'm doing this video. So just going to get you started. Uh, so here, I'm going to scroll in. Uh, actually, I don't want to do that. I want you to be able to see that what I want you to do is to put, uh, to make the text on this page look like the text here. And you'll have a second page starting with important contact info. So immediately I would put my cursor here and do a control enter to bump that down to a third page there. And then I'll come back here. And you can see that uh, to do this, I need to do many things. I need to uh, bold and probably make some things bigger here. I need to put some bullet points onto here and so on. And once you do that, don't forget about your format painter that lets you uh, put the same formatting from one thing to another. And you will make this a lot bigger. You will adjust your paragraph spacing here and here. Oops, sorry. Adjust your paragraph spacing. I'll go to the layout tab to do that. So we'll increase the spacing here and we'll increase spacing before this communicate to spread that out. Now, if I have 24 points before here, I should try to be consistent here so that there is the same amount of spacing. And I can see that over here it's wrapping uh, after the word for. So, you know, everything's going to be a little bit bigger. Now, you're not going to have to worry about having yours to be exactly like mine. You're just going to get it close and so that it looks nice and professional. And then continue on. That's as much as I will do. But on the second page, make it look like this.